to the remake which comes out this Friday. So I want all of you fans who appreciate the channel and what we're doing and fans of horror films to go back and rewatch the originals along with me. And for those of you who've never seen it before in the up and coming generation, check these out before you consider the new one because these are really worth seeing. Part 4, The Dream Master, was the most successful out of the series financially and the most well received amongst fans from my research. Uh, the film takes a more supernatural approach because inexplicable events are happening in the dream world and spilling over into the real world which gets creepy, muddled, and I think works. Uh, 4 is kind of just a fun film and doesn't require you to be too invested intellectually but rather invested emotionally. But yeah, check it out and Freddy is of course back, you know, as, as for this time, this era, no one else could perform as Freddy except for our lead man. So, you know, that's what he's going to be known for for his whole life and we'll probably constantly be revisiting whether it's in fan conventions, people coming up to meet him. He's definitely still inspiring people, so check these out. Check this one, the Dream Master, out specifically.